Hello, Taurus. <clears throat> this is a weekly reading for you guys. General reading. General love reading. Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs, guys. Let's see. Okay. I wasn't ready yet, but we're going to pick that card up and see what is going on. Because it wanted to come out. It flew out. It came. I picked it up. Upside down. Three of Swords. At the center of your reading is a Three of Swords. Whether it's reversed, whether it's upright, there is still a lot of hurt and disappointment. I feel like you're coming out of that, but... Uh, nevertheless, it's still there. It happened. Something happened where you guys felt distraught. You felt hurt in this situation. This is Libra energy here with the Three of Swords. I feel like um, there, there is an offering that somebody wants to make here, whether it's you or someone else. There's something that you want to contribute to this situation. Somebody wants to contribute something. Somebody wants to offer some truth. Somebody wants to offer a truce, even. Okay? It's crossing my Taurus friends. Then we have the Page of Cups. I feel like there is an apology that is on the table here that somebody wants to make. Somebody wants to make amends uh, and make an offer. And it's heartfelt. I do feel like this is an olive branch. I feel like um, this is a, a, a need to make an amends here. Whether it's uh, coming from you or coming to you. Okay? Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, energy there. But it's an underlying issue here for my Taurus. Five of Swords. Aquarius, energy. Whoever this is, and this is your reading, okay, but it could be the other person that's here as well. So the bottom line is there were a lot of issues that you guys had. There was a lot of bickering that went on between the two of you. There were fights that you had that that you guys felt like you couldn't recover from. I do feel like one person feels like they had the disadvantage in this situation. Very hurt. Very put off. Disappointed. very disappointed and hurt here. There's a lot of hurt between you and this person. And I feel like both of you guys like really think about it. It weighs heavily on you. But but one person more so than the other one inflicted a lot of hurt in this situation, okay? What's going on in the recent past for Taurus? Nine of Cups, you were doing you. You were doing what it takes to make you happy. This is a single card. It had absolutely nothing to do with anybody else. But whatever you felt like you wanted to do, you did it. If you wanted to date somebody else, you did it. If you wanted to travel by yourself, you did it. I mean, anything that you felt like your heart desired, you did it. You did what makes you happy. <clears throat> Chronic thoughts for... Taurus. Current thoughts for Taurus. Two of Wands. I think now you're kind of confused about where you go from here. This is Aries energy. Some of you feel like you just is the control is out of your hands. It's like you are relying on someone else to decide your fate. Is what I'm getting from you. You're just taking a chance. Like flipping a coin. 
here. But I, I tell you this, guys, if it's if it's something that you feel like you want, you can't ride the fence. And um, you, you can't say, well, there's nothing that I can do about it. Such and such needs to do this. If you feel like there's something that you should be doing. Okay? If you feel that way. <clears throat> it's coming in for Taurus. It's coming in for Taurus. Lovers. Gemini energy. You have to make a decision. How do you truly feel? Do you truly love this person? Do you feel they love you? Do you feel they love you with the lover's energy? Because I feel that both of you guys love each other. And if that's the way you feel, and you still love this person, you feel like this person loves you, then there is an amends that needs to happen between the two of you. I think egos are definitely in the way in your situation here. But um, I feel the love of your life is here. Okay. How does Taurus feel about this situation? Seven of Swords. You feel like you got to look out for you at the end of the day. And that is the truth. That is the truth. But are you considering um, the other person as well? Because the Seven of Swords is not always about somebody cheating, deceiving, you know, all that stuff. Sometimes it is. But sometimes it's not. It's, it's about doing what you need to do for you. Not necessarily in opposition of someone else. But just looking out for you in your best interest not necessarily trying to hurt someone and i feel like that's where you are right now like is this a situation that's good for me that's going to be good for me that's going to be beneficial for me am i going going to um be able to like strive uh in this situation am i going to flourish in this situation Am I going to have to watch my back? Um, is somebody going to do something fucked up to me? Whether it's some payback or whether it's like something that happens again, like it happened before, you know, because I don't know who feels the most hurt in this situation. I don't. But a lot of times in relationships, you know, shit goes both ways. Now, somebody may feel more hurt in a situation like I see here. Always feeling slighted, always feeling hurt and disappointed. But you want to make sure that that shit does not happen. And I don't know how you can truly um, figure that out. That's Aquarius energy with the Seven of Swords. <clears throat> What's the influence here for Taurus? Four of Wands. You want to be happy. This Aries energy as well. You want to be successful. You want some place to come home to that, that's a happy home. That's a happy situation where you guys get along. You enjoy being around each other. That's what you want. No backbiting. No fighting. Arguing over crazy shit. You know. Hopes or fears for Taurus. Hopes or fears for Taurus. Page of Wands. Aries got the same card. Excuse me. You want a fresh start. Hey, can we try this again? Can we date? For some of you, I'm thinking that, um, you know, you're hoping that there's still an interest, a spark with someone. Because you don't want to be um, rejected. Nobody wants to be rejected. Hoping there's something still there. Overall outcome here for Taurus. Six of Pentacles there. That's your energy. I feel like 
this is somebody giving something a chance here and there's one person I feel that is basically um, humbling themselves in this situation but I feel like it's going to be welcomed it's going to be appreciated okay so that is what I have for you guys and um, I'll be speaking with you guys soon namaste